Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to add a data traffic meter to your Nexus 5 status bar. Now for a lot of smartphone users keeping track of your mobile data usage is an important task. That's because unfortunately very few carriers offer truly unlimited data plans and if they do they're exorbitantly expensive. So it would be good to know when apps are running downloads or syncing data in the background because this actually happens pretty frequently. Well a developer at the GFAN forums has created a flashable zip that will display the exact data traffic directly in the status bar on your Nexus 5. This even shows you data speeds for your Wi-Fi connection so you'll be able to see how fast your real world speeds truly are. To get this one going you'll need to be rooted with a custom recovery install but if you need any help with those requirements just check out my article on Gadget Hacks. You'll also need to be running Android 5.1 since this is a system UI mod. But to get started download a copy of the flashable zip from my full tutorial. Then the next step is to boot into custom recovery. To do that start by powering your Nexus 5 completely off. When the screen goes black press and hold the volume down and power buttons simultaneously. This will bring up Android's bootloader menu. From here use the volume down button to highlight recovery mode then press the power button to select it. Now before you flash anything in custom recovery it's always a good idea to make a full Nandroid backup. If anything goes wrong or if you end up wanting to undo this mod the easiest way to get things back to normal would be to restore that backup. But with that disclaimer out of the way go ahead and tap the install button. From here navigate to your device's download folder then select the traffic only.zip file. After that just swipe the slider at the bottom of the screen to install the mod. Then when that's finished tap reboot system. When you get back up you'll now see your exact internet traffic speed displayed in your status bar. You can see that even when I'm not actively browsing the internet data is still trickling through. That's to be expected though but if you really wanted to restrict data usage you could disable sync options for your various apps and accounts then keep an eye out on this meter to make sure network traffic has stopped altogether. But for the full breakdown be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks but until then happy gadget hacking.